So assumable loans are the big hit right now because of how high interest rates are. So I did want to provide some general information about them. By no means at all is this all inclusive. And let me also start off by stating that I'm not an assumable loan expert, nor have I personally executed. However, what I can tell you from the lender's perspective is the basic overview of the process. So you as the assumer will need to be underwritten by the current mortgage servicing company that is currently servicing the loan on that property you're interested in. The two big things to keep in mind if you're looking to explore this option is timeline and cost. In terms of timeline, there is no standard timeline. You know, a, a standard purchase normally has a 30-day close. It all depends on the servicing company. I've heard from people that have assumed a loan before that it can take anywhere between 60 days all the way to six months. And in terms of cost, you'll need to bring a substantial amount of cash to close. Your down payment is going to be the equity that the current owner has. So someone that likely has an interest rate in the twos or threes that you want to assume, probably bought back in COVID times and have accumulated a significant amount of equity. So for example, if they have 75K in equity, then you'll need to have 75K on hand plus funds for closing costs. These two are normally deal breakers for people. One workaround is to take a second position lien where someone lends you the 75K you need. However, that second lien also has to be assumed. These are far and few in between since no loan company wants a second position on the house. However, if you're flexible on timeline and you've got the cash, it's an awesome opportunity to get into a house with a low monthly payment. Thanks.